Hello and welcome to this session. Today, let's look at how we can be able to use Chat GPT for beginners. So, if you are a beginner and want you are wondering how can you also start, how can you create opportunities using Chat GPT, this is where you are supposed to start from. So, the interface looks like this. But if you are finding it difficult to get Chat GPT, you, you can just go on and uh, type this way. You type Chat GPT on Google. And once you type that one on Google, you can see introducing ChatGPT, opening AI. So when you click on it, then it's going to appear here. It's going to be like this. If you just click on here to do chat, try ChatGPT, and you are able to come to this section. So this is the session for you. This is uh, like the projects you are working on. And also this is the working area. This is the search engine, search area where you search whatever you want. So let me just type in something, how to use ChatGPT. How to use ChatGPT. So yes, once you type that one in, it's going to give you the response. So this is a great opportunity that you can use to do your business, plan your business content, do blogging. You can even use to write a website. Uh, you can, if you have the prompts, you can be able to write different, different things. So it's even telling us how to use ChatGPT. And uh, you see that it's giving you all it takes for us to be able to use ChatGPT. So, and uh, it's, it, it, it's going to give us the content. It's going to give us all what we need. So let me stop it here. But it will generate content for you. So now that you know how to get into how to use it, you can just uh, go in. Whatever you are working will be saved here, and uh, you will be able to do more. So here, I'm just going to generate public speaking tips. I'm a public speaking coach, so I've said generate 10. Generate 10 public speaking tips. For social media. So just that for social media post. So it's going to generate the 10 uh, tips. So it's a show here. People talk about prompts, but if you don't know the prompts, please just type in what is in your mind and keep on refining that. The more you do that, the more you get better. The more you do it, the more you get better. So it's generating this for us. So, so it's a show here are 10 tips for public speaking that you can use for a social media post. Number one, you say know your audience. It says understand who you are speaking to. Number two, practice. Engage your stories. And uh, if you understand this, this is the all ways that you can be able to use public speaking and chat GPT. There are a lot of things that you can use chat GPT to do. There are a lot of things you can use chat GPT to do. And now uh, in the next session, I'll talk about how some of the things that you can use chat GPT to do. And you just ask your GPT itself, and it's going to give you all the things it can be able to do. But for now, these are some of the, uh, this is the best way to start chat GPT if you are a beginner and you want to go into the bars and create content, create opportunities. It writes everything for you, and you just have to take uh, advantage of this and create more content and do more. So if you are new, this, this will keep you kick-started. And uh, there are a lot of things you can still do. Next, we'll talk about the prompts and also this section where you can continue the writing, the continue the conversation, continue chatting with it, and you are able to do more. So thank you for your time, and uh, thank you very much. You can use this to do more. See you in the next session. Subscribe and like this. Share this to many people.